coming up in this video. Warning, if you have a heart condition, then skip this list, because these 30 scary videos are not for the faint of heart. Number 30, The Escape. These two are running from something. But from what? I'll keep you guessing. TikToker YCN videographer shares this footage of a terrifying encounter in an apartment building. <laughs> the stalker is watching through the window. Security footage then captures the creepy stalker leaving the scene. After walking the woman back to her apartment later, the man is approached by the stalker again. Did you see that twist ending coming? I sure didn't. And now I'm checking my pockets to see what else has gone missing. Number 29. Demonic Possession What you're about to hear is a potential demonic possession in action. Redditor the Mr. Morbid shares this footage of a woman being taken to the Monastery Ostrog to be exercised. As the camera gets closer, the demon bellows louder. Redditors provide more context in the comments. Many are suggesting this is more likely mental illness or substance abuse. While I agree that these are both possible, I've seen too many possession videos to dismiss the possibility of demonic possession altogether. Number 28. Ghost Park. Come out and play. YouTuber W Paranormal shares this phantom footage at an amusement park. Watch closely. Did you see it? A ghostly figure stands in the darkness. Look again. What is that? My guess would be the ghost of a carny, or of a carnival goer who lost their life. Whatever it is, it looks to me like it doesn't belong here. Number 27. The Roar. What would you do if you heard this roar while deep in the forest? YouTuber Darling Darkness shares terrifying footage of something unseen. <laughs> this bellow is powerful, but what is causing it? The YouTuber believes it's goblins, as they've been reported in the area. <laughs> While I don't necessarily think this is goblins, I do believe it's not of this world. Number 26. Woodlow's Homestead Located in Cannington, Western Australia, Woodlow's Homestead is purportedly haunted. And here is video proof. Listen closely as YouTube team 
Night Watchers Paranormal Australia captures disembodied voices in their midst. The first capture sounds more like noises than discernible words. But while they're using a spirit box, they capture another distinct disembodied voice. Apparently, the spirit here likes music. As they continue to interact, they hear more voices. But if these voices gave you the chills, this parting message will set you at ease. We don't mean harm. I know. She's not. That tells me there won't be any evil attachments here. What a relief, for now at least. Number 25. Knock back. Ask and you shall receive. YouTube team PNW Paranormal shares this footage of an immediate response from the resident ghost of this haunted home. They ask again, and they get a subtle answer. What is knocking around this spooky place? My guess would be a ghost that has heard one too many knock-knock jokes. Number 24. Demon Encounter This demon is causing destruction. YouTube team Wokaya Ra's high official attempts to net the demon, but it so far is eluding them. As they continue to track him down, they finally spot him, but the capture doesn't go as planned. They try their luck again, but still fail to nab him. And in fact, it starts to pursue them instead. But in its pursuit, it seems to have trapped itself. Was this capture a true success? I'm not sure if the demon was able to break free or not, but I have a feeling this isn't the last we've heard from him. Number 23. Chateau de Vous in my opinion, ghost hunts like this are the best kind. YouTuber Enjoy Phoenix Marie Lopez and her team are investigating this haunted French chateau when she hears a loud clunk. <sighs> During their tour, they hear something again. Gigantesque, vous devez vraiment prendre conscience. Ici, il y a une petite. Euh... Chapelle, du coup. C'était quoi? And a noise resounds from above. Oh wow. C'était où? Je sais pas. Genre, on aurait dit en haut. On aurait dit un bruit qui venait du haut. Ouais. The house is creaking, but is this just normal house noises? As they receive communication from a spirit through a paranormal device, Marie feels something touch her. Fifty-three years old. Hand. 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 Hand
Was she really touched by something evil here? It seems to me that a malignant spirit lingers, and it continues to provoke even in the afterlife. Number 22. Demon This haunted house is no joke. YouTuber Jasko and his friend Ben encounter paranormal activity there, and it starts in the attic. What the f***? Bro, there's something upstairs. Yes. I really hope these mics are picking it up because it sounds like footsteps. Many souls here. Many souls here. Okay. As they attempt to reach the attic, they hear more noise. The woman scares me. Which one? Julia? Julia? Does she scare? What the? F what the f is up there? Uh, animal? I, I don't. He abandons the attic for a moment, but upon entering his room, he sees this mysterious door has been opened. I want to go explore. Why the f is that open? Okay, I, I literally came in. Okay, you know, hold on. When Jasko asks the spirits for a sign, they give one. What the f is that? What the f was that? And in another part of the house, Ben is dealing with his own poltergeist. Glass dolls are kind of. Oh, f uh, the f bro. Okay, no, 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 no. I'm done. Nope. That room where I got scratched. In. Later, when they try to go to sleep, something taps at the window. They decide it was probably one of the beds bouncing against the window, but after going back to sleep, they hear this. Oh, what's that? Ben, the door's closed. The door over there is literally shut. The 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 thing, the lock okay. is swinging. Yeah. The lock uh, is literally swinging. Okay, get your. They then head downstairs to take a look around, and Jasko sees something that terrifies him. What the f is that? I swear to you, something was in that f room. I okay. swear, okay. Ben, I swear to God, something in that f room. As they didn't capture what they saw on camera, we'll just have to take their word for it. But after all I've witnessed here, I believe them. Number 21 Crying Tombstones. YouTuber Adam Ghost Trapper enters this mystical haunted graveyard to investigate the so-called crying tombstone. Oh great, great, I found it. It's exactly the same gravestone as I have on the picture. So if it's here, it's here. It cannot be some other place. It's a tough feeling, you know? It's a bit different. According to legend, a young girl visited her father's grave every day, but one day, she did not show up and was never seen or heard from again. Ever since, her father's tombstone cries on All Saints Day. Adam delivers some toys and a music box for the girl. Sorry, I start to hear something. Can you repeat it? It's not clear if this is a disembodied voice he's hearing, or an EVP through a spirit app. The energy of the place seems to touch Adam deeply. Oh, it's such a... It's such a sad, sad feeling. Oh, God. And then he sees the legend in reality. Look, look, look. It's tear. Look. Oh. It turns out the legend is true, and this makes me wonder whether the tears are those of the father or the daughter. 
Number 20. Deserted Village While visiting this haunted deserted village in Taiwan, YouTuber Zero One Supernatural Studio is getting creepy vibes. Uh, his K2 meter spikes even though there's no known energy around. Inside, the eerie feeling grows. And although he doesn't see anything particularly ghostly, his K2 meter continually spikes in this ghost town. I don't know for certain if this place is as haunted as they say, but it does seem to me that some energy lingers here, and I don't think it's going anywhere. Number 19. Gettysburg Haunting Inside the Genie Wade House and Gettysburg Orphanage, YouTube team Charm City Paranormal is surrounded by spirits. Is there someone behind me? Oh, wow. Their audio captures faint EVPs, and the spirits communicate through a ghost app, telling them who they're talking to. Honestly, we just really want to know who we're talking to. If you can tell us that. Jim. 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 That, <laughs> that was instant. That was crazy, man. Hi, Jim. But are they speaking with Jim or with Raymond? If this is James or Jim, if this is James or Jim, if this is James or Jim, they hear a knock. Yeah. You're in the two. Yeah. There it is again. It sounds like it's downstairs on that side. And then someone tugs on one of their shirts. Just flipped the shirt. Show. Show. It's like this. Show. My shirt Show just went. Outfits? Like it just tugged you? Yeah, it went like that. <laughs> and I'm not, I'm not near anything to like bump into or. No. That'd be and later during an estate session, one viewer hears an EVP right after Mike says the word leave. See if you can hear it too. Can you tell us how many children in this building? Leave. What I'm hearing is mommy, which is even creepier since David just said, children died in this building. I think this reveals just how dark the history of this place is. Its child spirits are roaming the afterlife, trying to find their mothers. Number 18. Waverly Hills Sanitarium what waits inside Waverly Hills Sanitarium? The YouTube team Paranormal Quest is about to find out. And it starts with a woman singing. And it wasn't just the patients. Wow. That's a car. That's a car. That was not. As they continue in a long dark hallway, a presence makes itself known. Is there somebody standing there beside Ryan? The spirits communicate a bit through the spirit box. Don't you just want somebody to talk to? Come on out and talk to us. If you'd like, you don't have to. When they ask the question, they get a deep reply. Is your soul trapped here?
The morgue. The morgue. I heard the morgue. I heard the morgue too. And it turns out the spirits aren't in a great place. We don't like it here. Did you hear that? But the craziest captures occur when they leave their equipment in the sanitarium to record. Strange shadows are seen. At this point. And footsteps are heard. Is this one of the spirits with whom they've been speaking? I believe it might be. And I wonder what happened that kept them here in limbo. Number 17. The Mole Prison. Here you are shackled. The YouTube team, Musel Delaror, enters the terrifying Mole Prison. And they aren't the only ones here. Hey! Cubo! Nada, nada! Hey! After this exchange, they discuss whether or not they should continue. Okay, hay una persona, hay una persona. No sabemos si solo sea una. They decide to go on, and as they explore, they hear footsteps. They find no one at first, but moments later, this happens. They spotted someone amongst the cells, and though they don't catch them at this time, they get a second chance. Is he seeing a real human or a ghost? I don't know what he saw for sure, and neither do you, but I have no doubt something has scared him here. Number 16. Lunatic Stalkers. Look out, you're being followed. YouTuber Angelo of Exploring with Angelo teams up with Brad on a randonautica adventure that will make your skin crawl. The trio winds up in the woods where they first come across this mysterious clue. Is that a pentagram? Uh, no, because a pentagram has to be upside, down. Be upside down. Yeah, so this is more like a like a spiritualist kind of thing. It's huh. like a dream catcher, though. Kind of, eh? The yeah. way they kind of made it. And an old phone. There's something written on there. You see that? No way. Did you find something? Hmm. So it's four, five, three, and then three, two, two. I don't know what that, if that means anything. It could just be like part numbers for the phone. But. Amongst their other clues is this letter. It says, uh... Cameron had always been a seeker. From a younger age, he had been fascinated by spirituality and the quest for meaning in life. Isn't that weird how we found that thing and I'm like, oh, that's like a spiritualistic thing. Yeah. They're then led to this mysterious sign. Oh, Okay, well, that's... What does it all mean? They find masks in a shoebox. What is that? Mm -hmm. yeah. Along with this message, Can I grab it? Dude, did you really think we would forget you? You have been chosen. Okay, dude, what the This is looking more and more cultish by the minute. After finding this ominous robe, they hear something in the darkness. Yeah. Oh. 
Okay, that's... That was definitely down there, yeah. Who's out there? As they consider what this might be, they hear other strange noises. Kind of weird, but let's... What the f*** is that? You hear that, right? It's like laughing. Somebody's, somebody's there. Who's there? Was it laughter? If so, what are they laughing at? This is one rando nautica that I'd leave behind me because all clues point to danger. Number 15. UK's most haunted forest. Are angry spirits stalking the YouTube team Moxley's paranormal world through the haunted woods? Upon entering, they're discussing their experiences here when they hear something. Them as well, don't we? Because obviously this is not far from where I live. A few friends come up here with the dogs and said that there is a couple of guys who live in, in some cabins up here. They then come across this scary gash in a tree trunk. What the f that? Can we come out night vision for a minute? Look at that. Turn that torch off for a sec. Man, people are like Was it people or a fierce forest creature? They start to feel something is near. It doesn't feel like I'm on my own now. I mean, I'm not on my own right now with you, but I mean... But, I mean... What was that? Yeah, I heard it. Oh, mm. Worst of all, they come across this enormous print in the mud. Something's just been stood there. Yeah, they're fresh. They are so fresh, them. Why would you stand, like, that there? Facing that way. Yeah, they're facing over there, aren't they? And then they hear this mysterious crying noise. There it is again. What is lurking in the woods? Angry spirits? Demons? I don't know for sure, but what I do know is I'd be staying far away from these woods. Number 14. Shanley Hotel. The Shanley Hotel is reputed to have been the hotel for everyone from presidents to mafia bosses. The YouTube team Ghost Trip Investigation visits the Shanley and they decide to play a game of cards with the spirits. Deceased. Deceased. What am I holding, spirits? <laughs> They think the spirit said Joker, not quite right, but then... That Adam has in his hand? Or what game you used to play with them? Did you say that that was a king? I said. I said. You did say that. What about the other... Did the spirit know one of the cards was a king? I didn't hear it too clearly, but this next time I do... When we pick the king up, listen to this. Wow. Wow. That's a king. Wow. That's a king. Right, we're going to head upstairs, guys. Miss. 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 I believe these guys are playing cards with some ghostly card sharks. And if I were them, I'd fold. Number 13, get me out. YouTube team Ouija Brothers returns to a haunted house that previously left them speechless, and it does it again. The f is that? Honestly. A second camera captures the bang from a different angle. The f is that? Honestly. In another room, they hear more noises. The loud noise, it comes from the other kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> and the mysterious sounds have no end. Was that you? No, something just w w hissed at me here. Yeah. Another buzzing sound occurs in a hallway. Is that you?
Is that you? They keep wondering what this buzzing noise is, but can't find its source. Oh, it was, that was loud. Oh, f yeah, you're right. Sh sh it's something <laughs> deep, boys, man. Something deep. And then they hear what sounds like a voice. What was that? That was talking, wasn't it? It was some, it was some kind of noise. They say they think it's coming from the walls. What was that? That was talking, wasn't it? It was some, it was some kind of noise. There's no doubt in my mind that this place is incredibly haunted, and not by a single ghost, by a posse. Number 12, trapped underground, while playing Randonautica, the YouTube team, Dark Arts TV, gets trapped underground by their stalker. They are led to this overgrown shack where they find mysterious clues. Is it blue? Oh, bro. How's it going here? Oh, mate, 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 mate. Oh, it's, bro, it's, there's, a, there's a red light on it. Yo, there's a red light on it, man. Yo, get back. Yo, there's a red light on it. Mate, the, the red light on, on the device, man. At first, they panic, but then they take a closer look. No, don't even touch it. Your wire's not on it. Look, it's, it's been blown up. Yeah, you can clearly see. Whoa, oh. Whoa, no, it's whoa. not. That thing's full. Don't touch it, Carl. They pry the detonator off of the device. Oh, that's not sensor. That's gotta be in a remote. Man, that's a remote down here. Holy <laughs> Seems like whoever is stalking them is dangerous. Later, they're led to this underground tunnel. But you be careful. The whole place is caving in. Once inside, they find another clue, but a moment later, this happens. Should we take this? Should we take this? Huh? Let's take this. No! What? Wait, 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 Yo, what? We'll kick it this way, Carl. <laughs> oh, that's your Luckily, they escape with their lives, but I think this was too close of a call to ever Randonautica again. Number 11, Shadow Figure. What is lurking in Redditor Dixon Hermoth 23's hallway? He explains that he keeps seeing something pass, Darkening the light in the hallway. Just watch. And then I'm gonna do an experiment for you after you do it. I will open the door as soon as it does it. See that? Nothing's there. Nothing. The light darkens again a minute later. There it went again, guys. You see that? Look. There's no way somebody could have moved that fast, look. Some in the comments are also hearing voices saying, I can see you. There's no way somebody could have moved that fast, look. And leave. Well, I think those whispers could just be from a TV in one of the other rooms. The shifting light is harder to explain. Some in the comments are surprised, while others try to find a logical explanation. And then I'm gonna do an experiment for you after you do it. I will open the door as soon as it does it. See that? Nothing's there. Nothing. Could it be just a pressure differential? Or does a paranormal entity haunt this hallway? I'm unsure about this one. In my opinion, this warrants further investigation. Number 10, Baby Ghost. Could you cohabitate with multiple spirits? YouTuber Ali H's home is haunted, and this time he's hearing a baby cry in the night.
He arrives home to the sound. 3.40 in the morning. I couldn't sleep, so I went to the gym really, really early. And I just came inside. I just got home. And I just started baby crying or some shit. He hears something in the room. Something already beeped. Something over there. And that's where it sounded like it came from. Like that's where the crying sounded. Like it was coming from, so. With a Connect app, he sees this. Again, next to a musical item. And it looks like a baby. And it's moving. So, don't come at me saying that it's just taking the shape of me. Then he starts feeling things and hearing things. I started something ice cold just touched me on the back of the neck. They wanted me to come closer. I just heard a noise coming from there. If this is a portal, what have they let in? How and why is there a baby here? I have a feeling that this story has just begun. Number 9. Haunted Attic This attic is coming to life. The YouTube team Get Spooky Society experiences some crazy activity in the room above. What? Are you hearing that? Yes. Okay, so everybody knows the REM pod that's been sitting there is now going off and that cowbell is going off again. The message they receive is creepy enough. What? But it's the devices being triggered that really have the team questioning things. It also sounds to me like something is messing with the camera's microphone. Blood. Are you hearing that? Yes. Okay, so everybody knows the REM pod that's been sitting there is now going off and that cowbell is going off again. Is there a spirit in the attic? After watching this, I think there's no question about that. Number 8. Graffiti Tree Forest Graffiti isn't only city art. YouTube team Josh Survival Life enters Graffiti Tree Forest, where the trees have names and the spirits are reaching out via the Necrophonic app. The spirits ask for help more than once. His K2 meter also spikes in the middle of the forest. While using his dousing rods, he feels like there's someone behind him. Spirits on this land. After being told that there are spirits here, they point him in the right direction. Which direction is a spirit standing? Are the lingering spirits one of the many whose names are carved into the trees? That's my theory. I believe that if you carve your name here, you're cursed to walk this forest for eternity. Number 7. Abandoned City This former tourist city was abandoned after the tourist industry in Japan declined in the 1970s. It is now the ideal stomping ground for urban explorers. YouTuber AWE83 visits the haunting place, which you enter over a wobbly bridge. I'm not gonna lie guys, this bridge wobbles like <laughs> Steve and Dan got off. Josh quickly run the other side. I'm wobbling the bridge, I'm sorry. I love a bit of fun. Though most of the Hot Springs Resort is in disrepair, some of the buildings are still in use. So you can see, obviously, later on, some of the hotels are still in use. But as I said, 16 or 18, or I can't remember now, at the beginning, uh, is about... He tours the dilapidated place, left to the elements. Now I'm going to chuck my mask on. It's really strong in here, guys. Like, really bad. And he leads viewers into the darkness. Oh, 
this is so dark. Wow. Kitchen area. As this place was a hot spring, the hotels have some impressive baths. These were luxury hotels. And you think back in the 80s. This exploration is actually pretty dangerous, as many parts of the building are falling apart. Shows you how bad the floor is in this section. Not even like I could just see the daylight then. See it? Ooh. They arrive at the second hotel, and you can see why this place was so popular. Second hotel. How quick was that? It was like lightning. We just literally up on the roof, straight across in the fire exit, of, out of the fire exit, straight in the fire exit, the second building. Look at this. What is I think it's sad that the resort has been left to rot, along with the former staff. And stuff, I'm guessing all parties that have happened here. To me, the scary thing about this is that what existed here was once lively and glorious. Who knows what will remain of us after? Number 6. England's Most Haunted Cemetery A ghost girl is believed to roam England's most haunted cemetery. YouTube team Ghost Club Paranormal investigates, and they have made contact. This is an image of the little girl that paranormal detectives captured on a previous visit to the cemetery. The visit's contact starts with noises being heard in a building on site. Later on, near the tree where the ghost girl was seen, their REM pod senses a presence. I have to go in front of it. Can you make it stop? At first, this seems like an intelligent being, but then the REM pod starts going crazy. There's no reason for it to do that. Fresh, fresh batteries and everything. Fresh batteries. As they attempt to communicate, they hear footsteps behind them. You were trying to give a message. Why don't you try and give it to us now? Did you hear that? Yeah. It's kind of it's familiar there. They look around, and their camera captures this EVP. That was heavy there, wasn't it? Yeah, no, that first off... When they ask the spirit a question, it responds. Should we be here? As they continue their tour of the cemetery, they hear a deep groan. Is that you I can feel? What the is that? I think this was either one of their stomachs growling. Or it's the ghost girl who is actually a demon, masquerading. Number 5. The Babysitter Who is watching the children? Shared by YouTube channel Cold TV, this creepy image is trending in the Vietnamese-speaking YouTube community. I could not find a video associated with the image. In the photo, two small children are playing outside at night, oblivious to the fact they're being watched and not by their parents, by this. The figure appears demonic. I get the uncanny feeling it's a spirit, not a living human playing dress up, and I don't like how she's watching them. There's something wrong with this picture. Bottom line is, these children shouldn't be left unattended, with something like this haunting the countryside. Number 4. Skinwalker did YouTuber Hype Mike capture a skinwalker on camera? See for yourself. Do you see that thing? Who's that? That's why. I don't know. 
Hello? Who are you? Are you like the owner or something? Somehow, I doubt this is the owner. Hello? Don't worry, we were gonna pay. Why are you just standing there like that? Can you say something? Michelle, hurry the up so we can get the here, please. I'm doing it, I'm doing it. As the figure doesn't answer, things grow uneasy. They hurry it along, but they haven't moved fast enough. What? What the f What is that? His eyes! Okay. His eyes! Okay, Michelle, I'm done. Michelle, Michelle, I'm wrapping Michelle, it up. up. I'm wrapping it up. up. I'm wrapping it up. Like, it's seriously? done. Put the money and let's get That thing is for sure supernatural. And when they turn around, it's gone. Hopefully they're happy. Michelle, it's gone. No, I don't have a good feeling about this. The men had red glowing. At least they assume it's gone, but it may be closer than they think. I'm not sure if it was a skinwalker, but either way, I wouldn't be messing around with any being with glowing eyes. Number 3. Pet Cemetery This pet cemetery in Nevada has mob connections. YouTube team Paranormal Voyages visits the old mafia stomping ground, and they've been here before. Do you remember us? Is that I do? Yeah. Okay. All right. The victims of the Mafia were buried here. They knew no one would go looking for human remains in a pet cemetery. That makes this spirit box message even creepier. The team starts to feel uneasy. feel here is, is a little more different, Jonathan. What are you feeling? I feel like we're not alone right now. They receive another relevant message, and then hear footsteps behind them. Buried. It said buried, is what it said. I'm hearing shuffling. I don't know what it is, though. They hear the shuffling again and a warning. Whoa, 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 whoa. Shuffling, shuffling, shuffling. Where? Behind you, shuffling. Behind you. It just said behind you. It just said behind you. <laughs> is that a mobster or one of their victims? I personally think that whatever is in the cemetery with them is harmful and they should watch their backs before they end up swimming with the fishes. Number 2. Three Shadows This land is cursed and now it's haunted by shadows. YouTuber Christy D. Abnormal Paranormal says she was taking video of a lightning storm when she saw three shadow figures pass her window. Take a look. What was that? I'm not sure, but the figure seems to cover the entire window, blocking out all light. Christy notes that the shadow is outside and isn't a reflection. If it's not paranormal, I'd be making sure my house was locked up tight and then lock myself in my room. I've got a challenge for you. Since you've made it this far, why not like this video and hit subscribe in the next 5 seconds because I upload 4 new scary videos every week. If you're curious about what I look like in real life, then go to my Instagram at DylanIsChillinYT and tap that follow button to find out. Number 1. Haunted Bridge Challenge 3 a.m. alone on a haunted bridge? What could go wrong? YouTuber Carlos the Fam accepts the challenge. Okay, there we go. It is a perfect pentagram. It has all the markings and everything. That's what was burning. What was that? Maybe he's being paranoid, or maybe something's watching him. He starts to hear distant banging. <laughs> he
He keeps hearing noises all around him, and they're freaking him out. So, I'm a little scared because I'm hearing noises all over. Sound like something told me to get out, to get out of here. He's so worried, his head is on a swivel. All right, so I'm gonna open it up. I'm probably not gonna show it too much. You're probably just gonna hear it. I don't know, that sounded like some sort of animal to me. Using the Spirit app, things get a bit too personal. By my feet. Did you just say my name, guys? Did you just hear say my name and say Carlos? Like in an evil voice. Leave. And then, whatever is here gets aggressive. Let me turn this up. Oh, dude. Where'd that come from? Who threw that? I guess that demon wasn't kidding when he warned Carlos to leave. That last bit could have made my heart stop, and for that reason, this video is not for the faint of heart. If you find yourself trembling in fear, don't worry, you're not alone. These are 30 scary videos that freak everyone out.